think we are the first ones here. Can't do it. I bet it's you can't the morning do it. of the first night, which you is Friday night. We spent the time at Mike and Jenny's house last night, just touring their farm and enjoyed some time with them. Got in late, got everything set up. And that was a real struggle. Yeah, setting up was terrible. We had um, a situation where we got our campsite got moved and we got put on like a hill. Well, we have an RV that weighs a lot, so uh, it wouldn't sit correctly. So we made it through the night and actually got it set up, truly set up this morning at another camp spot. So well, it was a bad the, day. The bad problem night. too is when we were using the jacks, the ground was so soft that they were just going into the ground. And um, we had to really just kind of complain to get somebody to either move us or help us. So The maintenance guy here was phenomenal though. It worked out where he came and he had some some help we got to move to a different campsite so now the kids are just playing we're waiting for everything to really get started tonight so just having the day and having fun relaxing Mommy's making some burgers, if you can barely see her. There's Faith and the press. They just pulled up. So we're trying to get it all done and get it set up. We're actually cooking some burgers. Faith said they already ate, though. Yeah. So we're going to get burgers fixed. And when they get on the grill, we'll also cook some pork for tomorrow for the actual hoot nanny. Yep. We're finally into the little bit more relaxation stage. Uh, two family is behind us. So we went over there and introduced ourselves to them. And we're gonna eat and just kind of hang out after all the stress that we endured last night. I think we're Sleep ready. Sleeping cooking. I think we're ready for some relaxation. Absolutely. <laughs> We are officially at Hootenanny kickoff. Places have filled, started to really fill up here. Um, the Pratt Pack is over there. Alderman Farms. We've got Freedom Homestead that is down this road. 1870s Homestead, 1870s homestead is down there. Two Family is down there. Um, several I know that I'm missing, but we, um, really starting to fill up. We're just gonna walk around and just visit. We've got kids playing, been swimming in the lake, and we're just gonna walk around and do it. Well, we've been having a blast, so we hadn't done as much filming as we probably should on this first day. Hey, dude. He's awake. Me and him hung out, cooking a little pulled pork. Aiden's been riding bikes with the Pratt kids and the Aldermans and also uh, Freedom Homestead. Hey. It's time to eat supper, and then we got ice cream, and we're gonna sit by the fire. Oh. Mike is, you see Mike, he's over here building a fire we're gonna all sit around in a little bit so good day we've had a blast stress fee cheese did y'all have fun today what did y'all do today tell me what y'all did swim 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 where at the lake at the lake harley what y'all do swim in the lake did y'all have fun mm -hmm. who'd y'all swim with um the rats and the um aldermans all prats and aldermans Y'all had a fun time? Mommy's in there. I know y'all can't see her. She's fixing plates for everybody. What are you doing? He's been people watching. He's having a blast. You been people watching? Huh? True morning of the homestead. Good morning. Look, look at my kids. Michigan weather. It's uh, what is it? July. Look, she's in a jacket. Look at this one. Sailor, are you cold? <laughs> Got a little cardigan on. 
We're not used to these cool, breezy mornings. What do you think, buddy? Is it a little chilly out here? Ah, oh, you see him? He's kind of huddled up. He's just trying to be cool. <laughs> All right, it's the morning of the hoot We had a great time last night. We um, sat by the fire by Mike and Judy's Fretz camper and fire, which they're over there. And Alderman's were there. Hodgepodge was there. Uh, let's see. Freedom Homestead. Uh, two Family was behind us. There were two or three other groups. I'm sorry. I just can't remember their names, but they were great people, nice people. We enjoyed just spending time with them, huh? 1870s Homestead was there. Thank you, A. Um, and there's a few more. We had a blast. So it was a, it was a fun time. Uh, but we were ready for today being the actual true hoot man. So make a little breakfast. You ready to eat? What? I'm not ready. I'm not hungry. Ready for coffee though, huh? Tell them where we're going. We've already got up and we had breakfast outside this morning. So we're getting everybody dressed and we are going to go down to the pavilion where the hoot nanny is going to be today we are taking pulled pork and a pan of cinnamon rolls and that's so that's what we're going to take we're going to have a big um a uh, big gathering down there we're going to eat lunch i think some vendors are going to be down there so we're going to kind of walk around and shop and um lots of homestead families are going to be all together under the pavilion so we can just visit and let our kids play and eat together so we're super excited about that this is this is the point of the whole trip so we're super excited and we are almost done getting ready and then we're gonna head that way we are off to the pavilion you know i'll be honest with you it's a little warm out here today isn't it, it it's, it's the weather is very nice are we in mississippi or michigan um, the weather is nice though. So, um, it is sunny and warm, but it's not like dripping wet sweat like it is back at home. Um, but it has been pretty warm these past few days. Shorts and shirt weather for sure. So uh, we're all Holly, stay on the road. In. You gotta stay on the road, there's like somebody gonna run over. Okay, so we are at we're fishing to start eating but there's bandana grandma's tent a few more tents we got the alderman farms and 18 1870s homestead freedom homestead um, there's several here i don't know this is a part-time permies tent right there and then there's two family homesteads so there's a big group of folks already here called baby adult.